All right, so in this What Happened Wednesday, I'm going to be talking about current and magnetism. Any motion or electric charge uh, can create a magnetic field. And you can see there the strength of the magnetic field is given by the Biot-Savart law. Uh, this, this form, it's in the, uh, the form of a point charge. You can see it's proportional to the magnitude of the charge and the velocity. And um, since it's determined by a cross product, you can use the right hand rule to determine the direction of the magnetic field from it. And then in a, in a current carrying wire, you can also use another right hand rule where your thumb points in the direction of the current, your fingers can wrap around and tell you the direction of the magnetic field as it is concentric uh, circles around the wire. Um, current from a magnetic field uh, can also be generated from relative motion within that magnetic field. So a sliding wire there can generate a voltage difference and then obviously a current. You can see the formulas there beneath the picture. And then the application of this is of course uh, in majorly the DC motor, but uh, many electric components as well. Uh, this is basically the entire principle behind why the DC motor actually works as we discussed in class.